Hi, this is Anton from Hardware Sugar, and today we're going to unbox the HTC Vive. This is just a simple unboxing. We will do a complete review of the Vive in our next video. So, the box is actually quite small considering that it has a full VR headset, and it has the two touch sensors, and it has the hub, and there's a whole bunch of cables in here and stuff like that, but the box itself is quite small. Um, it's a bit heavy, but not uncomfortably so. So let's open up the box, and I'm laying it flat on the ground because the headset is lying on its side. So, first things first, the VR headset with the coils to attach to the USB hub. And you'll notice that this headset even has its paper protective film still on there. Looks in good condition. I'm sure it works fine. We'll test it out later. Aside from the VR headset are the HTC touch sensors or the ones. Basically, you're going to be flailing your arms around using these things and they will track your movements in, in VR. I mentioned this in the review, but I'll say it again. The, each one has a grip button, a touch button here, and the, and the grip buttons. So you have two of these, one to your left, one to your right. You know that this is the second refresh of the HTC Vive because of the blue lanyard color. The initial HTC Vive had a white lanyard color. So if you're looking for HTC Vive, make sure you get the blue colored lanyard. And finally, or sort of the last of the main items are these two light box sensors. You're going to attach these things to your wall or you're going to mount them on tripods and they will basically face each other and it can sense what's happening in the gameplay area so it can accurately track your movements. Aside from those items, we do have a bunch of other stuff here. Let me just get to the bottom of the box. Um, basically, you have the charging cables for the USB hub and the light boxes and the sensors and things like that. Um, again, quite well packaged for its size. So that's one box there and the rest of the power cables and these babies you use to mount these things you can drill into your wall and you're, then you're going to mount the light box here and then they're going to be on your wall and it's going to be facing the gameplay area. So again, very compact design from HTC. It cramps in quite a lot for what you get. And I was super excited when I got my own personal HTC Vive and I will talk about that in the review. Thanks for watching.